hello everyone welcome to data Wolves. i hope you are all doing fine this is a new video on microsoft fabric that is a unified end-to-end -end data analytics platform launched by microsoft so in this video we will first what is microsoft fabric then how you can use microsoft fabric like without paying i will show you how you can use it for free and what are its different key components like power bi data engineering synapse everything I, i'm going to show you in this video and then we will see what are the advantages of microsoft fabric and then we will see how you can learn more about microsoft fabric like various types of tutorials webinars which are free that are provided by microsoft so without wasting time let's get started with our video so let's check first what is microsoft fabric and why it is launched by microsoft so microsoft fabric is an end-to-end -end unified analytical platform Basically, it is a software as a service platform that aims to simplify and consolidate various data and analytics workload. Fabric is basically integrating previous Microsoft tools which you must have used like Azure Data Factory, Synapse tools like Synapse Data Engineering, Synapse Data Science, Synapse Data Warehousing, Synapse Real-Time Analytics and Power BI. There is one more tool which is called Data Activator. We will check its use in this video. Along with it, it also incorporates AI capabilities like including Microsoft Copilot to assist users in tasks like building data pipelines, generating code and creating machine learning model just by writing a text. And all of this is built on top of one lake, which is a multi-cloud data lake provided by Microsoft. It simplifies the data lake management by providing a centralized storage system with an intuitive data hub. So let's check how Microsoft Fabric looks like. So if you go to this app.fabric.microsoft.com, this is Microsoft Fabric Home. So you can see there are various tools, Power BI, Factory, Synapse tools, all real-time data warehousing, all tools are there. You can use free license type. Microsoft is offering free trial for 60 days. So you can use this trial. So if you go to this powerbi.com, so we have different dashboards here. If you click here, you can choose data factory. So you can in data factory, you can create data flow, data pipeline. Similarly in Azure Synapse, using this data engineering, you can create all these data pipelines, Spark job, notebooks. Similarly for data science, you can create model, experiment, create notebooks. And for data warehousing, we have warehousing. Similarly for real time analytics, we have KQL database. Everything is there. So you can see from single software as a service that is app.fabric.microsoft.com you can use all these tools microsoft tools including power bi azure synapse and data factory so we have checked all the key components of microsoft fabric that is data factory azure synapse azure data activator one link so what's check let's check what is data activator so basically data activator is a forthcoming service in microsoft fabric that offers real-time data detection monitoring and triggering capabilities Basically, it allows you to define data patterns in Fabric and then automate tasks based on these actions, based on these patterns. So let's see what are the advantage of Microsoft Fabric. So first step advantage is Fabric is a complete analytics platform. So previously for building a BI report, you were first using data like Gen2 for storing the data, then Azure Data Factory for building pipelines, then Synapse maybe for building data science or ML models, and then Power BI for visualizing the data. Now all of these tools are incorporated in a single software as a service platform that is Fabric. So it is easy to use and everything is in on a single platform. Second is Fabric is a lake centric and uses open data format. So all the data is stored in a single Fabric layer that is one lake. Third is there is Copilot in Fabric. So users can use conversation language to create data flows, data pipeline, generate code, build uh, machine learning models or visualize the result. Fourth point is it reduces the cost. So previously you were uh, purchasing all like purchasing Power BI license. You were paying for Synapse, you were paying for Data Lake Gen 2, for ATF. All these costs are merged into a single license, maybe single, uh, not a license, but single use cases for Microsoft Fabric. Then fifth is improved security and governance. Now you just need to manage security and governance of a single product that is Fabric. So it is easy to uh, manage and improve security and it meets all the regulatory requirements. Six point is Fabric supports a multi-cloud approach and provide building support of, for 
Amazon S3 and Google Cloud Platform that is GCP. So most asked question is when Microsoft Fabric will be launched. So Microsoft Fabric is currently is in public preview. So it is allowing user to try its service without providing any credit card information for free. And starting July 1st, 2023, that is 2023, Fabric will be enabled for all Power BI tenants. So now how you can learn more about Fabric tutorials as it is very new. So how you can learn about Microsoft Fabric, how you can get hands on. So there are various resources which are provided by Microsoft, like detailing about Microsoft Fabric. So first one is Microsoft Fabric webinar series. So it is an official webinar series from Microsoft and it contains six videos. So if you click on this link, so first of all, I'm using datawills.com, um, like, uh, uh, an article published in datawills.com that is related to Microsoft Fabric. So you can check datawills.com to check this article. I'm using links from this article. So if you click on this first link, so here you can see there are six videos, basically webinars, webinar series from Microsoft detailing everything about Microsoft Fabric. So it has everything like introducing unified analytics, then data engineering with Microsoft Synapse. So everything is there like data science in Microsoft Fabric. You can check all of these videos. Second one is Microsoft Fabric blog. So if you click on this link, you will be redirected to Microsoft Fabric blog. So they are detailing everything like it is more of kind of documentation related to Microsoft Fabric. And then third is there is an ebook from Microsoft. So if you click on this link, then you will be redirected to this. You, you will be asked about your information. Then Microsoft will provide you this PDF. So it has detailed information about Microsoft Fabric and its use cases. So where you can use it, how to use Microsoft Fabric for free. So as I shared with you, you can start your free trial and visit app.fabric.microsoft.com. Sign up by selecting the try trial within the account manager tool in the Fabric app. And there is no credit card required. It is free for 60 days. So guys, that's all for this video. If you find this video insightful, then please do like this video and subscribe to our channel and feel free to ask anything in comment section. We will try our best to answer all of them. Check us out on different social media platforms like LinkedIn, Facebook and Twitter and check our websites that is datawills.com. So we'll see you in our next video. Thank you. Bye.